Good morning. Um, so I told you in a previous video how I was uh, getting my hands checked out because of some pain and you have all been very kind to show concern and asking me how my hands are. Sadly, there's no good news. I went to the doctor and because there, there was nothing showing up in the blood work, he uh, couldn't really do much. He said that he is going to assume that it's some form of long COVID, which I don't believe. I personally think it's something rheumatic. Um, this weather is the absolute worst weather for the pain. So mornings like these is usually when it hurts the most. The pain has spread to from my hands to also my feet hurting, my toes and the bottom of my feet and also sometimes my elbows and my lower back so it's a lot of different joints now hurting but uh, as long as there's nothing showing up in the blood work um, I probably have to go to a I would probably have to go to a private doctor if I wanted it checked out more thoroughly which would cost a lot more money so, for now, I'm kind of trying to wait it out and hoping that warmer weather will um, make the pain go away. Um, it definitely seems to be worse when the weather is cold and wet. So, And for rheumatic arthritis, for example, I know it's very common that people are that people are experiencing a lot of symptoms in the winter months and then the summer months are easier. That is the current situation with the hands. Um, thank you all so much for asking how I am. I wish there was some better news to tell you. Uh, now I really need to get to work. Let's do a little unboxing. I picked up a couple of packages at the work and figured I'd open them on camera. Didn't feel like showing my face though, so I'm just going to do a voiceover. Starting with the small package here, I ordered some pet-friendly CBD oil for my older dog Frodo. He's turning nine. Holy crap, can he be that old? Yeah, he's turning nine next fall, so he sometimes seems a little stiff and he's also a pretty sensitive dog mentally so i figured i'd just try this for him i'm still a bit skeptical but i mean it can't hurt at least i'm also contemplating ordering some cbd for myself as well for the joint pain and then this package i'm really excited about i saw this finished design enamel coffee pot from the 80s by heiki orvola for sale at a thrift store for like 40 euros last year and I didn't buy it then but I couldn't stop thinking about it since and now I finally found one online for only 20 euros. It's so pretty, I am especially obsessed with the wooden details on it. I can't wait to make myself some coffee on my wooden stove on cool mornings in this. I also recently thrifted this milk churn from the same product line. They're so perfect for an old countryside kitchen like mine.
I have quite a bit of this blue so thistle in my garden. The flowers are, are quite pretty, but it's a little too eager to spread. And my mom has planted some tulips here and last year you couldn't even see the tulips because these blue so thistles were just um, taking over everything so I'm going to at least uh, dig up a little bit of it um, might consider getting rid of it altogether but it's a pretty hardy plant so I don't know um, but yeah trying to at least let the tulips um, grow in peace here. I am out for a walk with the dogs and I hope you can hear the birds right now because they are going absolutely crazy. Back. Get the back. Get the back. 